In this video I will show you how to make an Enderman XP farm in Minecraft. It's really easy to build and it will get you quite a lot of XP. It will also get you a lot of ender pearls and it will fill up a double chest in about 2 minutes. To build this farm you will need 21 stacks of full blocks, 32 slabs, 2.5 stacks of leaves, 1 stack of temporary blocks, 59 carpet, some ender pearls, 9 hoppers, 8 trapdoors, 6 chests, a minecart, a rail, a water bucket, a chain and a name tag. So I'm going to grab all of the items and start with the tutorial. So you want to build this farm on the side of the end island, so I'm going to use this side since it's pretty empty and there isn't any other blocks around it. Then take your leaves and start building out like this, you want to place all 2.5 stacks. So once you've placed 2.5 stacks, place a temporary block right there, place 4 blocks like this. Go to this side and place 4 more blocks like this. Go in this direction and place 8 more full blocks. So you want to make a 9 by 9 square like this. So once you're done with that, you can break the temporary block and place a slab on the bottom half of the block. Then count 4 blocks in this direction and place a double chest on the 4th block. Go to this side and place 2 more double chests next to it. Now you want to connect the hopper to every double chest. Make sure all of the hoppers is connected to a chest. Then place 2 more hoppers behind every hopper like this. And once you're done with that, start filling in all of the empty blocks inside of the square. So it should look something like this. And once you're done with that, take your slabs and place it all around the square like this. Once you're done with that, place two temporary blocks like this, place a full block on top. And now we want to make a two wide platform above the platform like this. This new platform should not be above the hoppers and also not be above the slabs. Then place a carpet on top of every hopper like this. Take your water bucket and go up like this. Place down two carpets on top of every outside block like this. Once you're done with that, you should only have two carpets left. Then place two temporary blocks like this, place a full block on top and break the bottom blocks. Then go out 4 blocks in this direction, 4 more in this direction, and you want to make a ring like this, it should be 5x5. Five five. Once you're done with that, place 2 more temporary blocks, place another block above it, and make another ring exactly like this one. You want to make 13 of those rings in total. So this is number 13. Right above it, make another ring like this. After that, go to the middle block and bridge out 13 blocks. You want to do this on all four of the sides. It should look something like this. Once you're done with that, you can start placing blocks like this. This is the platform where all of the Endermen will spawn. And while we're waiting, if you haven't already, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Every like really helps me out a lot. So once the platform's done, go to the middle and place 8 trap doors like this. Place a piece of dirt in the middle, stand on top of it and open these trap doors. Just be aware the Enderman can pick up the dirt blocks. Then place 4 more dirt blocks like this. Place a chain on top of this dirt block. Place a temporary block to the side and place a carpet on top of the chain. Then you can break this block and as you can see some Enderman already took some of the dirt blocks. Then place a dirt block on top of this carpet. Fill it up like this and now you want to make a cage where you will get the Endermite. So just make a little cage like this. As you can see this block is directly above the carpet. Remember this block, this is where you want your minecart to be. Then you can make the cage two blocks high. Place your rail down like this and now it's time to get your endermite. So start throwing in the pearls. Just make sure to check your health since you will take damage doing this. And right there I got an endermite. So I made a mistake, you shouldn't place the minecart immediately, you should name it first. So let's just break the minecart and use the name tag to name it. Once that's done you can get him into the minecart and push him over to this block. So once the minecart's in position you can break this block, jump on top of it and break that rail. 
you can break the blocks underneath the minecart so that the minecart can fall. As soon as the minecart falls, the farm will start working. Then you just want to place another carpet on top of the minecart. And now you can break all of the dirt blocks. After destroying all of the dirt blocks, just make sure there isn't any other dirt blocks on top of the platform that some endermen may have placed. Then go to the side where the leaves is, place your water bucket, then go down with the water like this. Your farm is ready to be used. So as you can see, all of the endermen will be one hit. So now let's test it and see how fast we can get 30 XP levels. I'm going to use a sword of sweeping edge 3 and looting 3 on it. And as you can see, after a minute and 25 seconds, I got 30 XP levels. I also got quite a lot of ender pearls, so let me just quickly get all of the ender pearls inside of the same chest. And as you can see, after a minute and 25 seconds, we almost filled a double chest. I really hope you enjoyed this video, and be sure to let me know in the comment section down below what videos you want to see next. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.